Urban Movers as well as YWCA. Uh, we have a ton of internal departments at Conestoga. So we have our Conestoga Consent Culture team um, here. Uh, a lot of student engagement folks who are here supporting this event. Our campus management team and people across uh, the DTK campus in particular, lots of faculty and important um, and awesome folks who are doing amazing work supporting students here. So a big thank you to all of those people. Um, finally, I just want to pass it over to Amy Baird, who is our fearless leader in student engagement. So Amy Baird is the Associate Director of Student Experience and Engagement to welcome you all to this event. So thank you, Amy. Thank you, May. All right, I'm gonna be a little bit louder. I just wanna uh, do a little, uh, can we get a huge shout out for May? Woo! Woo! And Carolyn, who is another Carolyn leader who is sick today. Uh, and of course, again, just for our students, please like join me for a minute because you know what? Everything we do is through you, because of you, and honored to be here. And what an amazing day to celebrate, International Women's Day, and have such great support here. I think that uh, I'm honored just to speak and say a couple words. So I just want to say hello, thank you, welcome, and thank you so much for joining today. Uh, you know, today is really about celebrating social, economic, cultural, and political achievements of women. The day also marks a call to action for accelerating gender parity. Everyone, everywhere can play a part in helping forge gender equ equity. I encourage all of you to celebrate each other, lift each other up. I certainly am going to do a shout out for my 16 year old daughter who inspires me on International Women's Today. Uh, you know, and you know, we're all in this together and there's a lot happening. And so when we're here together, we're here to celebrate, we're here to learn, we're here to share. And I know I'm learning every day and I'm really privileged to be part of this team and be here with our students. Uh, there's lots of great activities happening. Uh, I'm going to pass it back over to May, and thank you so much. Awesome. Thank you, Amy. Yep, uh, my name is Hajra Fida, and I'm one of the members of this amazing International Women's Day Committee. Well, it's International Women's Day, and we must start by acknowledging the lands that we are all in. So let's go through that first. So, we are gathered here on the ancestral territory of the neutral, Anishinaabe, and Haudenosaunee peoples. Many indigenous nations, were matrilineal and women, and two spirited people, were celebrated for their gifts and for the care and strength they brought to their families and communities. As colonialism stole land, resources, language, and traditional knowledge from indigenous people, it also stole this wisdom that recognized the inherent value that women and two-spirit people bring to the world. Even more, wherever colonialism went, violence against indigenous women and two-spirit people followed and still continues today. Gender inequity is not just a standalone issue. It is tied to colonialism, to environmentalism, to racism, to poverty, to healthcare, and so much more. Look around the room. You may, you may take a second. Just look around the room. Each of us here today have our own unique gifts, skills, and abilities to effect change. We are resourceful, we are compassionate, we are leaders, and we are change makers. And we are all here in this together. Imagine what we could learn and share and do with all our gifts combined. Let's use today to commit to collective action that makes a better world and leaves no one behind. So let's give all a cheer for ourselves first. Thank you, thank you. I give it off to my co-member on the team, Saba. Thank you so much. Hello everyone. Uh, my name is Saba. I'm one of the student ambassadors at Waterloo Campus and one of the members of the IWD student committee. I also wanted to quickly um, give a quick intro and welcome to everyone here. Um, so this event is brought to you by the International Women's Day Committee in collaboration with the Student Engagement and the Employee Experience and Development Team. Um, the 12 of us committee members worked really hard over the last few months in order to bring you an event 
that is fun, engaging, collaborative, that celebrates um, the wonderful and incredible women in our communities um, and asks you to pause and reflect on how you embrace equity in your day-to-day -day lives and um, an event that challenges you to do more and go further. Today we hope that we all will think more about our lives, um, about our communities, and um, about how we can practice equity, diversity, and inclusion more in our daily lives. Um, we are really excited to welcome you all to celebrate, advocate, um, and to learn as one community. Thank you so much for coming. I hope this is a very um, fun and memorable day for each and every one of you. I'm gonna pass it to Megana, and she'll walk us through the agenda for today. Thank you. Woo! Thank you so much, Salva. Good afternoon, everyone. Hi. Hi. Good afternoon. Okay, my name is Megana, and I'm one of the members of the International Women's Day Student Committee, and I'm here to share the agenda for the event today. So, for the next part of the event, you are invited to grab refreshments, connect with other guests here, and engage with our awesome, awesome activities. So from now until 1 p.m., if you are registered for the event in advance and if you have a bracelet, please enjoy the Jamaican patties that we have by the Caribbean Kitchen and samosas by Home Taste Waterloo. And please meet our amazing community um, vendors. Oh, representatives from Shelter Movers, Shore, and YWCA. Huge Woo! shout out to them. Woo! who are here to tell you about their services and how you can get involved. And don't forget to learn more about how you can get involved with the 2F LGBTQ plus initiatives on campus and consent culture initiatives and play some fun games with our IWD committee members. Make some IWD buttons and sign up for some henna. Right? So finally, don't forget to take some solo or group photos with the modest booth that's right over there. And don't forget to put your ticket in to draw at the registration table because we have an amazing, amazing door prize waiting at the end of the event. At 1 p.m., we will welcome a special guest speaker, Michaela and Jameer, to share some of their poetry with you. For now, we hope you enjoy some of these fun activities that we plan for you as well as the playlist of female artists that was curated by us. Enjoy the event.